Well, jobs get even cooler, especially here on your Feel Good Breakfast Show. And this time around, a young student who is also a singer. So we love bringing in all the fresh talent. And here she is, Jerame Jafta, making waves, not just in 2014, but all the other time. Welcome to the show. Hi, thank you so much for having me. It's Only a pleasure. Cool now, I, I want to say it's good to have you in Cape Town because you're originally from Namibia. I am, yes. Well, I was born there. I always like make a point to let people know that it's Namibian born, but it's Cape Town raised. So, ah, so yeah. Cape Town raised. You're a singer, but you're also a student. So tell me about how, as Fresh Talent, you're a singer working on your album now in 2014, but you're also studying. Just tell I me mean, a little bit about you. Yeah, I am studying. I think it's important to like have your, like a side hustle. I want to say a main, but obviously like I love music, so yeah. But um, I'm studying a law degree and it's going. I mean, I like something to just fall back on, I guess. Mm. I actually love this, so. I think so most singers just, do that, especially if they, yeah. if they know that they, they're new or fresh at it. This is not the first time you're doing this. You started singing in the church, like most of us. <laughs> yeah, Tell me I about that. So. I think I was about eight when I started. I think, um, let me just see. Yeah, my dad's kind of a church guy. He's very active in the church, so that was the first time I actually sang and people were like kind of shocked. I think I've always wanted to sing, I just didn't tell anyone. So then one day I just kind of rocked up and did it and it was fun and I always knew like I wanted to do it. So yeah, it's been fun ever since, I guess. Even when I was a DJ, I realized that most of the songs that I play has your voice on it. Now, if, if, if she had to stand up, she's a tiny person in a very, very, with a very big voice. You were found by Rude World Record, yeah. the Rude Boys. Tell me about that. Um, well, I went to school and I think I did um, extra maths classes and that's where I met the DJ. <laughs> so that was like in grade 10 and then years later when I was on varsity, he kind of called me up and said, listen, I'm working on this project. You want to like be a part of it? Um, not knowing that anything was going to happen. We were just in studio messing. We just wrote something to a beat. And I think a month after that, it was playing on the radio. So I was like, okay, I'm going to stay here and just like work on this. And yeah, I mean, I'm like really grateful to have found them again, I guess. And then that's when the old Rude World Record thing started. And I've been with them ever since. And it's a good team. So I'm having fun. There is an album this year and I want to know all about it. I mean, you, this is one of the things that you're working on, right? Yeah, it's, it's important to me. I never say when it's coming out because you know how projects go, but it's definitely something I'm working towards and we've got all our material sorted. So yeah, it's just kind of building a following so that people can actually appreciate the music and they actually want the music, you know? So yeah, yeah, we're just doing that. I'm well, like always nervous about speaking about it because you know how it is and everyone's like, okay, so when's this coming out? And they're tweeting you. And you don't kind of want to say next month, next month, next month. So, well, don't be too nervous So it's like on the lowdown. So we can't cool. wait to hear more from Jerain Jafter in studio with us. Our fresh talent on your Feel Good Breakfast show, Express. And after the break, she is performing for us. I know that there's two singles that's making waves at the, at the moment. And she's going to be performing one of them for us. We'll be back with Jerain Jafter after the break.